A question I get all the time is, what kind of cool effect can I produce where I don't have to use any fog or haze? Most places where we play these days as mobile DJs don't allow us to use fog and haze. Very rarely do we get to. So yeah, what can you do? This is a cool, I don't know, effect you can use either on a ceiling or on a wall. And we're going to use a few different fixtures to make this happen. First off, we need a pretty bright hex LED fixture. Now for my purposes today, I'm going to use one of these. Ultra Hex Bar 6. This has six hex LEDs inside which produce red, green, blue, white, amber, and UV. I'm going to use the blue and the UV. We'll also be using this Micro Galaxian 2. This is a cluster laser. It produces red and green lasers. We're going to use only the green laser in this. And last but not least, the Pinpoint Gobo. This is a brand new fixture. It's like a Pinpoint Go. It's larger. It's battery powered. You can put gobos inside. You can also put colored gels inside. We're just going to use a stock gobo that comes with the fixture today. If you want to know more about this light, let me know. I'll do a video on it real soon. Let's go ahead and set up the Ultra Hex Bar 6. Real easy. We're just going to plug it in. I've already got the light set up on it. It does have a menu here. I'm using full-on 255 power UV and 100 power blue. Now next up, we'll set up the Galaxian 2. I've already set this up with the eye remote to give me only a green laser. And then of course, our pinpoint gobo. Super easy, we just hit the power switch on the back and we've got light. Now this is also eye remote compatible. We're just gonna point it straight up at the ceiling. Now that we're all set up, let's have a look at our effect. This is just kind of a foundation for you. You can expand on this if you want to. If you want to light up a larger surface, of course, you can use more hex LED fixtures. Also, you don't have to go white on this gobo. You can go color on this gobo. You can also rotate it. Or alternately, if you want to have a lot of fun, you can use a moving head. And then use a DMX controller to program your moving head to move how you want it to move and rotate the way you want it to rotate. Just a concept. What do you think? Let me know in the comment section. I'm just turning you guys on to it who maybe haven't tried it before. So there you have it. Thanks for watching. Practice and enjoy.